52 winning lioness Jill Scott. Very good morning to you, Jill. We understand you're down in London today. Just explain exactly what you're doing. Yeah, so I'm working for Howden's and um, they've done a great initiative where they're fitting kitchens in a grassroots club. So a kind of it's one of them where you see the difference that a kitchen makes to a grassroots club. Obviously, they can put more events on. Everyone can get hot drinks and they can raise money because there's a lot of grassroots clubs out there that are underfunded. So, yeah, it's a great initiative and grassroots clubs can still apply by the end of January to get their free kitchen for their club. Jill, big news over the past week or so, an England manager, Savina Wiegmann, has signed that contract extension until after the World Cup in 2027. How much of a boost is that for all the players in the country? Oh, it's such a boost. I think Serena's record speaks for itself. Um, a fantastic person, a great manager. And yeah, I'm sure the Lionesses, as well as all the England fans out there, will be so happy that Serena's staying. I think I'm constantly just texting her, like, well done on another award, well done on another award. So yeah, I'm so pleased for her and so pleased for uh, English football as well. Yeah, copy and paste, that's the way forward. Um, what can England achieve uh, in that time frame? <laughs> uh, obviously, there's a possibility of a World Cup final showdown with Emma Hayes as well, isn't there? Yeah, yeah I haven't thought about that one, actually. That would be a fantastic game. But, yeah, I think England can achieve anything under Serena. And, obviously, you look at the players that England have got, Chloe Kelly, Lauren Hemp, God, I could go on forever. Leah Williamson, Millie Bright. It's an exciting time to be a Lioness fan. And, yeah, obviously, Euros, World Cup. I think Serena and the Lionesses can, can win it all. So, yeah, it's exciting. But now that you mentioned maybe a Serena and Emma Hayes final, I'd definitely be getting me tickets to that one.